Well, hello there, everybody. Dre here, and welcome back to the game where I clean things and you watch for some reason. We're back out in Power Wash Simulator doing the final of the new bonus levels, and this is the Spanish Villa. Much bigger than the other levels, so this could be a pretty interesting one, and as you can probably tell, pretty dirty. I also love the cat prints that are pretty much everywhere. I think there's an actual outline of a cat laying here. It's the small details that are so cool, man. Sometimes I want to follow these and just see where they go. Like, what the hell happened over here? The cat's just doing typical cat things and wandering pretty much everywhere. Does it actually climb? I see that. Yep, yeah, it goes all the way up to the top. I want to know what's up there now. Okay, another cat sitting spot with a tail outline. Dude, I never actually looked too much into these. We got blood on the wall. That's great. No, it's just grime. Cat sat in the chair, wandered a little bit more all throughout this. I see we have the gnome in the distance having a wonderful little vacation in his canoe. At least I think that's the gnome. There's definitely a pointy head there. I can only assume that's him. I guess that's good. We already found him. Uh, I don't think the cat trail really leads anywhere. Unfortunately, it's just a typical cat trail. So I guess we should start by cleaning this thing. Why is the uh, stack at the top so clean? All right, but this is the perfect level to go right down the middle and compare and contrast between the clean and dirty side because I can already tell that this is going to be very vibrant when it's done. There is a lot of color under this mud. All right, so I'm going to do my best to go right down the middle. Can't reach that, unfortunately. And yeah, we're just going to have this nice line. Oh, it's all white, too. This is going to be so satisfying when it's done. This is going to be a big job, too. All right, and there we go. It's not perfect, but we got a line going down the middle. Now we just got to clean one of the sides. I guess we'll go to this side because the part's already cleaned up there and it's going to bother my OCD if I see a clean part on the dirty side. All right, we have everything at our disposal, so I don't think this will be too hard. Honestly, when this power washer came out or this nozzle really made this game a hell of a lot easier and I, I guess that's maybe a good thing the game did take a long time to uh play before that was added to the game but yeah as you can see it just takes me like one swipe mind you this is gonna be a big map so it is gonna be hard regardless but yeah definitely the game's a lot easier now with this new uh, triple nozzle all right there is a lot of dings we even got a little art here this is gonna be great uh, I am going to take my time and try and get all the dings I can because I want this side to be as clean as possible before we move on to the next side. So, yeah, we're definitely going to take our time. What is this? I almost feel like this is a hidden door or something like that. All right, and there is the first wall pretty much done. Did miss some at the start, clearly. Must have rushed that. And there we go. The actual wall is done. I think I'm going to go try and do this roof now. This might be a little bit of a hard part. Only because this thing is not flat at all. Also, when I go close, these things spread. Um, so we're going to go to Stubby. See if that helps a little bit. And yeah, I think I'm just going to have to go over this quite a few times. Because there's going to be a lot of spots for dirt to hide. And it gives me lots of room for error too. This might be the most satisfying job ever. I don't have to worry about being too frustrated. All right, there's one pass on the final side. Go on the other side to get the pieces that we missed. And that rigid roof is done. Uh, I think we're going to go back to the actual courtyard. This is super satisfying to clean. Uh, work my way inwards here so we get to the center. Well, I've ruined everything. As you can see, I made a little bit of an oopsie here. So, uh, yeah, I'm going to have to restart the whole level. Just kidding. But look at how satisfying this tile is. These are the type of levels that I truly love in this game. Just like really vibrant, dirty big maps that is truly the best part of this game and i am just enjoying all of this tile so much so much so i even went back to the yellow uh power washer just because it's more satisfying to watch and look at how deep this dirt is like this is so good all right well that was super satisfying i often realize i forget to commentate in this game this is truly a game where you just kind of zone out after a while and just enjoy it and uh i do that a lot but the actual front courtyard, whatever you want to call it, oh, is done. And look at how clean it is. Look at how pretty it is on this side and how gross and ugly it is on this side. That's what I love. All right. Now we just got to work our way up. Literally, I may as well start with this staircase and slowly get to the actual villa itself. 
All right, should be able to get all this done with like one swipe. This is going to be super satisfying. Uh, so yeah, I don't want to have to use the ladder if I don't need to. We're going to back up a bit. Those are a little bit too spread. Like, look at how OP this thing is. Seriously, <laughs> one swipe and everything is clean. All right, a uh, little bit of an update. As you can see, I have been uh, trying to expand out the line area and uh, that always takes the longest because I really don't want to screw up this line. So was going slow and steady and it's looking pretty good if I do say so myself. Not perfectly down the center of the map, but I'm happy with it. So we'll finish up this floor, which is very nearing done now. Let's go over to uh, overpowered nozzle and make sure we don't have any of this grime anywhere with this thing all right and there we go just getting all the dings done uh let me just take a peek around i did take my time and try and find all the dirt i am as you can see highlighting right now i think this is very clean okay there's some small things like that this is why you have to look around it has to be perfect damn it can't have any spots anywhere and the lanterns were the issue this time clearly Oh, hell yeah. All right, do a quick swipe of this, and then we're going to have to get on the ladder and get up even higher. Uh, there's actually not much left. I want to see how close we are to 50%. I always like to try and challenge myself to get to the big 50% when half of the level is done. We are currently at 43%, so we actually have quite a ways to go with only a small area to clean. I don't know how good I'm doing, actually. All right, so I think, yep, there we go. We got the shutter done. I think that's as good as I'm getting it. Oh, actually, I forgot about that roof over there. I guess that's technically part of everything up here. So we'll head up this way and start off over here. This will be nice and easy to clean. I don't have to worry about breaking the line down the center of the map. Oh my God, I'm already at 48. I'm going to have more than 50% done, which actually kind of makes sense because as you can see, I didn't do it exactly down the center, so we probably will have over 50 if I'm doing a pretty good job cleaning this all. And it's looking like it's definitely going to be well over 50%. All right, and after cleaning out this area, as you can see, we did already hit the 50%. Uh, I didn't even actually clean it that well, as you can see. We still have some over here. I forgot. That's what I was working on beforehand. 51%. I can't believe that. I'm... I think I'm doing this pretty neat, damn near perfectly. Okay, got all those done. So that roof is nice and clean. Clean this little garden here. Obviously get this pool. Okay, and this is where we have to take our time again. So I'm going to go back over to yellow. I'm going to go to the OG way of doing this because it's easier to be precise with this. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. I'm doing the final thing, which is the most dangerous because I'm staring at the dark area and look what I just did <laughs> at the end. I should have just left this pole. You're never going to see this from over there. God damn it, man. That is brutal too. It's on the red roof. Ah, uh, my OCD hates me. All right. Well, screw doing that pole. I'm just going to clean up anything that I miss like this giant area over here. <laughs> I love how I'm so defeated with just that small mistake. I have spent so much time just trying to keep that line perfect. I mean, regardless, it looks so freaking cool. I guess technically I made a small mistake there too, but nobody's looking. And <laughs> it's so cool every time. I love doing this. I don't know why. Oh, crap. I totally missed that pull. Hold on. I have to fix this. It's going to actually bother me. Oh, I actually missed all this railing too. I am a professional. I should be a lot better at this by now. All right, I think that looks pretty good. And now you can easily see the difference from clean to dirty. As per usual, always super satisfying. Now let's, uh, well, finish up the rest of this and get it all clean. Oh, now I can breathe and just go insane, which is my favorite part after being so tense with this line for this whole episode. I can just do this and this I shall. This lady just keeps talking about cats, by the way, which kind of makes sense. There's about 15 cat trails in this damn thing. And just like that, we are at 70% done. And I'm gonna have to go over everything again. And there is the floor clean. That's a pretty good quick first pass. We'll get the rest of these done. Like, look at how quick this is with this thing. Even if I'm rushing, I get pretty much all of it. Hit hitting tab now. Only thing I'm missing is like the small details like the uh, planters and whatnot. All right, we'll worry about that later, though. Moving up. <laughs> it's going so much faster. 
Okay, the final major bit, 85% done. Of course, we're going to use the extended and just slowly swipe upwards here. This should rapidly make that percentage go up. 88 already. 89. <laughs> oh, I'm too powerful in this game now. There we go. And just like that, the majority of the map is clean. Now we just got to go get all those small areas that I missed. So we'll view it from this side now and swipe again. And that will likely put us close to 99%. 96, good enough. And the rest of this dirt is definitely down here. It looks like a shadow. Ah, uh, the stuff I couldn't see. So here is the final major bit. And this should definitely put us at least at 99. Well, yeah, at 99. We're not going to be 100 because I have been rushing this side very much. So if you are curious, the uh, one side took me about 50 minutes and the other side has taken me about five minutes. <laughs> so if you are uh, rushing and not trying to do that, it's not too bad at all. All right, get the final little pieces of dirt and now it's the fun part. We have to actually look for where all this dirt is hiding and that is that. Um... Okay, hitting tab, not seeing much of anything. I doubt there's going to be much on this side because I took so much time here. Probably over here I missed quite a bit. Uh, these things? Why is there no flowers in that pot? <laughs> no, I'm actually not seeing much dirt at all. Uh, oh, there we go. Small things like that. Oh, and I missed kind of this. Pretty much all of this. All right, pool is clean. I think that's everything here. Oh, no, we need the ornament done. So that's probably the underside right there. And a little more over here. And ding dong. Thank you very much. I think that's everything here. Oh, courtyard vase. I, I knew this vase would be dirty. Ah, it's the top. Now, is there one on the other side? No, there's none. Why is that like that? That bothers me. All right, we got wall planters that definitely need it. Ah, ha ha. I found the hidden dirt. Anything on that? Yes, of course. Seeing some dirt here. Oh, yeah, there we go. That's where you were hiding. And we have this side railing that nobody ever looks at. Oh, wow, we have this whole pole here, too. Perfect. Pole's done. How am I going to get to the other side of this side rail? We actually are missing both of these, so got that one. Why is this one so hard? I can't. Can I jump over? I mean, there's some on the top. There we go. Aha. There's some. Oh, wow, I missed a whole bunch here. Perfect. I'm struggling to find anything. That makes sense where all the dirt is. Um, all right, we got the staircase wall, so it's probably on this side. And that's done. Is that connected to this one? Yes, it is. Okay, so that's all done. All right, I've went around the whole map. I think I've officially run out of ideas. I'm thinking it's still very much up here, maybe. I'm pretty sure I got these. Yeah, I'm hitting tab. I don't see a damn piece of dirt anywhere. So I hate doing this, but we're going to check. And one, two, three, four, five, six. I did a lot worse than I thought. Okay. As per usual, the 1% is always so hard. What the hell's a corbel? I think that's those top things. So it's, it's one of these. Yep. Aha. Of course, I should have assumed you were dirty. You're right at the end. And more corbels. Okay. It's the stupid corbels. I don't even feel bad. Um, Where are these ones? These down here? Are any of you blinking? It's probably this one. Or that one. Nope. Oh, it's right here. Oh, both of these. Damn. One and two. Got a dirty door frame here. Yeah, I can see how I missed that. Very hard to get. All the dirt's right over here. I can't even angle myself that far that way. There we go. It's kind of awkward. And forgot about the porch railing. There was actually a lot of dirt on that one. Where's the dirt? Ah, oh, there. A little bit there. Perfect. Upper Casa window ledges. I missed one of those. Two out of three. Oh, these ones. Oh, it's these little guys. I thought they were all connected, but no, there's the actual ledges that can get dirty. Okay. I missed a whole wall base. That's probably this side. Courtyard wall base. What the hell's the base? Oh, these things. Oh, no, it was my clean side. I'm a complete failure. I, I left a little bit of dirt there. How dare I? And now we got feature garden edgings. All right, so that is these. One of these is dirty. Or sorry, two of them are. It's very easy to miss these. So yeah, there's one. I'm pretty sure I've already cleaned this one. So it's got to be this guy. Yep. It's very dirty, actually. Oh, yeah. Jeez. It's a problem when you have to clean something orange. Your radar doesn't really make it pop out. 
But there we go. Staircase fountain bowls. Uh, so that's this one. And yeah, there's obviously a lot of dirt there. It's so obvious when you know where the dirt is. And staircase railings. Not one, but two. That's embarrassing. So that's these, I'm assuming. Oh yeah, it's the other side. Right there. There's one. And there's two. <laughs> Oh, dude, that was so satisfying. And as per usual, got to watch the ending where I slowly take my time. <laughs> and then the other side is just rushed. <laughs> ah, that was a really fun level. Always love the big outdoor levels. Uh, yeah, that was super satisfying to do, and I hope you guys enjoyed it. And that's going to wrap it up for this episode, guys. Uh, don't have anything else I can clean in this game, I don't think. Uh, but I do know that there was a Back to the Future DLC coming soon. So if you guys are enjoying this, let me know in the comments below. Uh, and yeah, I would love to uh, check out that DLC when it comes out. As always, thanks for watching and liking. And I'll see you in the next one.